What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes with you for OutdoorNewsAmerica.com. Today kicks off day number one of SHOT Show 2024 in Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm going to be walking the show, covering the show. i um, going to interview as many people as possible for you today so you can see all the products that are there, all the new products, all the latest inventions. I uh, hope you enjoy it. So let's go to SHOT Show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes, OutdoorNewsAmerica.com. This is our first interview, Mike, SHOT Show 2024. This is my good buddy Mike Humphreys with Springfield Armory. They got some cool new stuff to show you. Mike, show us what you got here today. All right, well, thanks for putting us at the head of the line for the show. Absolutely. I appreciate it. All right, so actually we launched today a four and a quarter inch version of the Garrison. It is brand new for the day, so the timing is excellent. So if you're not familiar with the Garrison, it's basically a classically styled 1911, has some upgrades. It isn't like a mill spec, but if you know what a 1911 looks like and you know the way they've looked for a long time, that's what a Garrison is. It has some upgrades. It has a beaver tail grip safety. It has a slotted hammer. It has improved three dot sights, low, pro low profile sights. Very nice. But basically you are getting an all steel classic style 1911. Now we released the five inch versions. They, the five inch versions were available or are available in stainless or blue in nine millimeter or 45. We launched those probably a year and a half or so ago. Okay. Brand new today is the four and a quarter inch version. Still all steel, blue and stainless, nine millimeter or 45. You're basically still getting your classic heavy duty 1911, which you're getting in a little bit more compact, a little bit easier to carry version. Now, what's the MSRP on this, Mike? These are very reasonably priced. The MSRP on this stainless gun is 917, and MSRP on the blue gun is 868. Fantastic. So you're looking at a pretty good street price, and like all Springfields, has forged primary components. So these are very nice, very well-made guns. Are these all made in America? They are. US all made, made in America. That's always a good plus, guys. Hey, Mike's a good friend of mine. We always conclude him in all of our reviews and be looking on the on the website as well. We're going to be doing some detailed reviews uh, on the new colored Helions. Is that how you pronounce it? Helion? Hellion. Hellion. I call it Hellion, you, Helion. If you buy one, you can call it whatever you want. You know, us rednecks in Tennessee, we have a hard time pronouncing <laughs> anything. But yeah, hey, so stay tuned, guys. Let's keep covering the show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes back with you. Shot Show 2024. I'm here with my buddy Brandon at the Ruger and the Marlin booth. That's right. And we're going to cover a little bit of both of these products, but yep. the first thing we want to show you guys is some cool new things from Ruger. So Brandon, show us what you got here. Yeah, so the big news for us is there's now a Gen 2 of the really popular American Rifle Series. Yes. Um, always been a great value, you know, just great features and things. We've really kind of amped these up with a lot of new features. So first thing you're going to notice right away, of course, brand new stock. It's got Very a nice. really good finish on it. You know, we get the free float on there. But what's cool about this thing is you've got the cheek riser. Okay. And then you also have um, the ability to extend the length of pole. Oh, I see that. Yeah, that's nice. Yep. So you've got some spacers in there that can go in and out. You also have a brand new butt pad on there. This is really soft. Just a, a soft, just a the super comfortable butt pad yeah. on there. So, you know, the new stock is, is kind of a, a really nice feature. You see the fluted barrels. Yes. So, Gen 2, fluted. We've got the, uh, they're all going to be threaded, the state's allowing, of course. I actually won one of these at yeah. a Friends of the NRA okay. banquet. It was a 762 by 39. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I've loved yep. it. It shoots great. I haven't had any problems with it. So, yeah, so I've, these are fantastic products. Reliable, accurate, great rifles. And a good price point. Yeah, and it's going to stay that way, you yeah. know. So, um, you're getting a lot of new features without a lot of cost. And somebody wants to find some more information on this, where can they go to see that? So, Ruger.com. Ruger.com. Yep. Check them out. All right, so we're going to go across yep. the road. We're across the booth here. We got some more Ruger products to show you. Stay tuned. Guys, continue with my buddy Brandon here in the Ruger booth. One more product from Ruger right. we want to show you today. Yeah. And this is pretty sweet. Brandon, show us what you got. So this is a brand new product we launched here at the show. This is the Ruger LC Carbine, yeah. now in 45 Auto. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's just it's America's cartridge, right? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. Great, great, great cartridge. Not only that, um, but it does use uh, standard Glock pattern magazines. Oh, wow, so nice. any of your aftermarket mags and things like that are gonna, gonna work with this gun. Um, 45 Auto, okay. naturally subsonic, right? So when you use this threaded barrel with right. a suppressor, right. you've got the uh, very inexpensive, very suppressible rifle as far very as that nice. goes. Yeah, What's an MSRP ammo. on something 
something like this. So it's about a thousand bucks MSRP. Oh, that's not bad at all. Yeah, yeah. That's not bad at all. I remember yeah. when nobody had had mastered the forty-five carbine. Yeah. And it was it took forever to get that rolling, but once yep. it got yep. rolling, it's great to see you guys coming out with something like that. That'd yeah. be a great super truck compact. gun too, man. You put that on the back seat. Yeah, super compact. Tons oh. you can accessorize the rails all over the place. So I love that. Lots of room for optics. Lots of room for lights and all that sort of side thing. charge and handle. Side charge. So it's a hundred percent ambi or reversible. Okay. All the controls can either be flipped or they're ambi. Very nice. So yeah, that side charger will go either way. The stock will fold either way. Oh wow. Yeah. So you got a lot of options. So if you're lefty thing. or righty, you can set you can it up. Work with that anyway. You bet. Awesome, Brandon. Thank you so much, all guys. Right. Let's go see what's up for Marlin. All right, guys. Here with here Brandon with Marlin Firearms. We'll get to show you the Dark Series now, Brandon. This is pretty cool. We did run an article on this, by the way. But hey, you got to check this out, Brandon. Show us this Dark Series lever action rifle. Yeah. So we brought back the Dark Series. This is in uh, two different ones. You got the 1895, which is your uh, 4570. Right. And then your 336, which is the 3030. I happen to be holding a, a 3030 right here. Super sharp. Yep. So you got your Dark Series Marlin, aluminum handguard, M lock all the way down. You've got your uh, sling uh, QD sockets yeah. on there. Um, pick rail, ghost ring, rear sight, fiber optic front, uh, polymer stock also with the QD. Nice butt pad on there. You got more M lock in there. So nice bit of texture. Wow. Here's um, no telling what haul some bonanza could do with that thing with he had that back in the day no kidding right? <laughs> yeah i mean it's just it's, it's just like retro modern i don't know what the word for it yeah. is but uh you know having all these you know more modern features on, on a real retro lever gun is just tremendous i think that's fantastic now what would something like this run you had to ask i had to ask it man <laughs> if you don't know we can put it across the screen at the bottom that's right. no we'll look that one up. we'll look it up hey you know yeah. he's got a lot of products here if you can see them at the booth it's hard to remember yeah. everything here right yeah, absolutely right. so guys stuff. let's keep Keep covering the show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes, Outdoor News America, continuing coverage of 2024 SHOT Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. Here with my longtime buddy, Gordon Bond. And Gordon's got some really cool stuff to show you guys. Gordon, show us what you got here today. All right. Hey, guys. Uh, th thanks for stopping by the booth. And uh, I'll show you a couple of the new things. So the uh, 4570, which has been really a great seller this year. I mean, it's, it's crazy. This, this is the brand bragging rights gun. And yeah, this I've, is, I've shot that and I brag about it all the time. There you go. And the, and the other thing is, this is the gun that you get that you let your friend shoot. <laughs> and and so it's got the bullet on the other side of the barrel. And it don't just, cost you a lot in ammo either. No, it doesn't. It's <laughs> one shot. <laughs> but uh, sing, single bore, uh, the extra weight really helps with the mitigation. Uh, guys, this has been like our top selling gun this it. last year. I mean, I it's, it. it's really done well. So we had a rough series gun, which, which is like yeah. where you have the bead blast. And so it became so popular we went ahead and did a package deal so we have oh, a fully nice. fully polished one now with the uh the, the cyclops leather. matching leather holster that's right i love that and so nice nice little package so uh check that out on our website um we also added the uh, 44 mag for those who are a little intimidated by the 4570 and and you know i've shot both of these yeah. And I don't notice that much of a difference between the two. There you per go. Personally. Yeah. Personally. And, and it sort of depends on what uh, round you're shooting. Yeah. Yeah, because the 4570 can go from cowboy loads to hot, hot, well, that's hot. that's true. That's true. And so, but the 44 mag, uh, I, I tell you what, if you want the 44 mag to feel like a pea shooter, shoot the 4570 first. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> so the other thing that uh, we had a lot of requests for, which I thought, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> so everybody wanted a 50 caliber Derringer. Wow, look at that. Yeah, 50 AE. Isn't so, that something? Um, and after you shoot it, you'll understand why we call it the thumper. I bet. I Cause, bet. Because it thumps. Now, you didn't call that the Bond Eagle. No. <laughs> <laughs> Probably should have. Probably so. <laughs> should have, but you know, hey, I still like it. Really cool. Now, that's also a single shot, right? Yeah, single shot all the way. You know, and people say, well, why'd you do a single shot? And they say, well, you probably need time to recover between I shots. Bet. Now, I got a question. Yes. Like a lot of the Bonds, are these barrels interchangeable? With other Cyclops. With the other Cyclops. The, the you only have a single firing pin. This one, this is a Shogun, so yes. it doesn't have the firing but pin But if in you there. bought the 50 AE, you could buy the 4570 barrel. We will 
we'll have those available soon. Okay, great. Yeah, great. right now we're just doing the guns. I got you. Uh, but I the, got you. The, the barrels between the calibers, and we're <laughs> as soon as you do a 50 AE, yeah. somebody wants the 454 Casol. Sure. As soon as you do the 454 Casol, they want the 460 Nitro. Absolutely. As soon as you do that one, they want the 500 Smith and Wesson. So yeah. you know, I mean, this could go on. And for a lot a of your bond owners are collectors. So yeah, they are. They'll not buy just one. That's they'll right. buy a whole right. set of them things. But these are the beast rounds. I love that. So jumping down to the smallest, uh, here's the uh, Stinger, and you can see how much thinner that is. Oh, wow. So this is the aluminum frame. Yes. We put the B6 grip on there, which gives you a way better hold. This is 22 mag, and we're calling this the Stinger Fireball. Stinger Fireball. Now I like a 22 mag and round. And feel myself. how light that is. Oh, gosh. Yeah. How that many is, ounces is that? Uh, that's a, probably 13 ounces. Oh, wow. And that's so for sweet. those who want something to really drop in their pocket, yes. uh, 22 mag, still a really nice round. Absolutely. For, uh, personal protection, but really nice grip and really lightweight. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Now, what's this big boy we got right here? Uh, this is the, uh, the the lever gun, the okay. lever B. Yes. And so we we actually showed this at Shot Show uh, 2023. Okay. And it, I think we included that in our video. Yeah. Uh, Recoil Magazine named it uh, best firearm of show. Wow. As our prototype. Sure. So then we went, oh wow! Now we got to figure out how to get these things made. Oh sure, so, sure. Uh, so we're 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 getting close. This is a final prototype before we start going into production. Okay. We we should be in full production uh, second quarter of this year. Very nice. Uh, it's a short throw. Uh, mag, mag fed, uh, regular. I uh, got a couple of different mag releases. There one where most people are used to having it. Right. Uh, then you've got the. Uh, excuse me. Uh, you got the w one here and then one on the other side. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna send it out as a two two three wild. Yep. Which means you can do the two two, uh, two two three and five five, five six. six. Um, a lot of requests for three hundred blackout, so we'll, we'll have that too. Yeah. Uh, a lot of requests for three fifty legs. So we'll do that in as the near future. Yeah, yeah, as we progress. Um, since it, it's you know the, with it, since this is a locked breech because it's a lever gun. Right. When you shoot, you don't have the the bolt bouncing back and forth. Right. So right. the recoil when you shoot this is about half of what a regular AR yes. is. Yes. Yes. And so it's it's really nice. I bet that is nice. Now what's what's something like this going to run? Uh, Fifteen ninety nine is oh, what we're looking at. Oh, that's a great price. Yeah. Fifteen ninety nine. Well, Gordon, hey, thank you so much for sharing with us today. What, sure. any, anything else we missed? Uh, go to bondarms.com uh, if you want to sign up for our email list. We'll okay. keep you updated on the new products and Perfect. when this will come out. So. That sounds great, guys. Hey, right. bondarms.com, check them out. Let's keep covering the show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes back with you for OutdoorNewsAmerica.com. Shane, we're continuing coverage of the 2024 SHOT Show yep. here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Here with my new buddy, Shane, from Escort Shotguns. And boy, does he have something cool to share with you. Shane, show I us do. what you got. This is the Bulltac semi auto semi auto this is a 12 gauge this one is a 12 gauge that's a 12 it's available gauge. in 12 20 and 410 oh wow uh, five plus one in the mag tube with our quick load system very cool uh, about seven pounds fairly lightweight bullpup design uh, Chambered in three inch, but you can use two and three quarter shells as well. I even see some fiber optic sights on this yep. thing. They come with a fiber optic front sight, adjustable, micro adjustable, and flip rear sight as well. Very cool. And obviously, um, rail on top, you can put whatever kind of red dot or whatever you wanted on there. Rail on top, an accessory rail on the bottom as well. Also available in a pump action. Okay. Version so you can get it in a pump well. or semi -off. Correct. Yep. So this would be a great bedside home protection shotgun yeah, absolutely no absolutely. not really for your skeet shooter probably not with the 18 inch <laughs> barrel no uh but yeah excellent home defense option now if somebody want to get some more information about this product where sure. can they go to do that escort shotguns usa.com escort shotguns usa.com you guys are out of arkansas arkansas out yep. of arkansas so i'm in tennessee so i'm okay. not too far yeah, away no, from not you. at all so great thank you so much no Shane. Problem. guys hope you enjoyed that let's keep covering the show what's going on guys josh sykes from outdoor news america back soon you coverage of 2024 SHOT Show here in Las Vegas. I'm with my new friend Jessica from Colt, and boy, she's got a really cool revolver to share with you guys. Jessica, show us what you got. All right. So you guys have been asking for, what, five years now for us <laughs> to bring back the Blued Python, and we finally got around to it, and we put our blood, sweat, and steel into this. I like that. So it is a forged carbon 
stainless steel cylinder barrel frame and you have a one piece barrel construction just like the stainless okay recessed target crown you've got that um, ramped front side up front that is removable interchangeable oh wow and just like the stainless you do still have 30 percent more steel underneath that target adjustable rear sight just like the stainless yeah you have more of a robust design okay and that, those innovations that we put into the stainless python very nice still has that linear leaf spring action that you used to that gives you that nice crisp trigger pull okay and as you can see you've got walnut grips yeah i like this those time, grips those are really that nice gold medallion to really throw back to that heritage of pull i like and it. our original blue python you know i've got um i've got a very very old colt revolver that was my great grandfather's that i've cherished all these years i mean and it's just it's pristine so i don't know why i said that but i just <laughs> want to share that with you and everyone anyway, shares everybody their shares stories that's the oh, thing yes, about shot show you know you share mm -hmm. stories so guys thank you i hope you've enjoyed that let's keep covering the show Josh Sykes back with you, continuing coverage of 2024 SHOT Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. Chad, are you tired yet? A little bit, a little tired, but he's, we're good. We're doing good. Chad's been doing this a while like me, so he's been around the block. Once or twice, a couple times. I'm here with my buddy Chad from EAA, and Chad has got something pretty phenomenal to show you guys. Chad, show us what you got today. So we have our new Witness 2311 family. So we brought these out, shot last year. Right. They shipped this year, done really well with them. Well, we've got some updates to the line then now. Okay. Okay. So we've taken just our standard four and a quarter nine that we've been shipping. Now we've got the new kid in town. That is our 10 millimeter, wow. six inch pig murdering machine. That's a beast. That is a 15 round, 10 mil. We can also do this in a government. We can also do this in a commander in a You're 10. You're kidding me. No. That is phenomenal. We've got all the standard guns. We upgraded them with our sights okay. to the new far dot, which is solar. So took our original far dot design updated it with the solar option okay, now very nice and you're still totally free on the gun oh really it's rmsc footprint underneath it so you can put whatever optic you want Sweet. on there but as of right now it's a 9.99 street price plus you're getting the optic for free that's probably the least expensive double stack i've seen on hands the down that hands down um, especially in a nine millimeter in a 45 in a 38 super or a 10 millimeters who else is going to do it and nobody has the baby oh wow so now you have an officer size full grip officer fray officer slide full rail wow still a 17 round capacity and that's still the 999 price still the 999 price unbelievable point. optics ready as well really cool guys i'm gonna tell you if you hadn't keeping up with eaa lately you need to look them up online it's eaacorp.com 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 you got one more to show i got one more this oh, one's yeah. super special this is our custom molded grip wow. so if you buy what 2311 now you can actually have in the box so it'll be a little card that has a custom grip option for you so we can actually mold the grip to your hand unreal I mean, you notice on this one you can see finger grooves in it you can actually see the veins of somebody's hand that's insane how do you do that we actually have like it's like an invisalign process yeah. like a mouth guard so okay. it's a, little, a block you get sit in the mail you drop it in hot water pull it out grip it it molds your hand you send it back 3d molds it was basically 3d scans and molds you a grip that's really cool. totally custom i like that a lot guys again you got to check them out eaacorp.com eaacorp.com can't go wrong and all that now if they wanted to order these they can pretty much any dealer in the country any dealer in the country you can get them absolutely that's fantastic guys let's keep covering the show what's going on guys josh sykes back with you still covering shot show 2024 here my buddy mike from gpo optics that stands for german precision optics if you didn't know that mike's got some cool new things to share with you today mike tell us what's new and new and good happening here here at gpo we've got a whole series of new stuff coming out this year a bunch of new products but the but the two things that i think are most important to get the message across we are introducing a 10 by 40 and an 8 by 40 range finding binocular these are extremely compact they are the smallest 40 millimeter class range finding binos in the world right now oh, wow super small super small they are 3500 yard range finding capabilities wow. angle compensation 3500 yards 3500 yards who can see 3500 yards you guys want to know how far the mountain <laughs> is away i guess i guess so uh but I'm yeah problem reading the newspaper in the morning long range uh <laughs> it's got a hyper scan system in it so okay. when you press the button it scans where you, when wherever you're looking yeah, yeah. and the response time's lightning fast you're getting three readings a second holy so smoke. the display changes before your eyes can actually look at the display wow no lag and no lag time It'll, that would be really great for my golf game because usually 
especially when I'm close to the green. Yeah. I'll hit it about 3,500 yards <laughs> on the other side of the green. Yeah. I'm just messing uh, down, down the mountain. <laughs> yeah, down the mountain. So that's really cool. So, anyway, super cool. So, angle, angle compensation technology, temperature, barometric pressure, humidity, smokes. nine brightness levels, um, photo sensor for auto brightness. I mean, it's it's crazy packed with electronics. Wow. And What's the price point on something like this? This is going to retail for $12.99. Okay, okay. But you're really getting two or three things in one. Uh, you're Absolutely. You're, yeah. you're getting a ballistics tool. You're getting a range finding tool. You're getting a binocular tool. That is pretty sweet. That's very cool. Pretty sweet. And, and now you also have a full line of rifle scopes out this year too, a new line of those, right? That's correct. All we've right, always, let's see some of those. We've always had kind of a starting price point category and then a premium category, but we really need to fill that middle section for the American market. Okay. So this year we are introducing an entirely new series of rifle scopes called Centuri. It's all based on American standards, so it's quarter minute of angle adjustment that has a zero stop locking ballistic turret. It has a MOA ballistic reticle inside with micro dot illumination technology. Wow. I mean, these are super, super scopes, all built around the high demand features that American field guys want in their scope. Oh, wow. Really, really cool. Really. This whole series is going to retail between $4.99 and $5.99. Oh, wow. Point. That's a fantastic price point. You really did hit that middle of the road. We hit the middle of the you road. You know, that's, there. I mean, honestly, today in optics, even at that price point, that's that's still a good price yeah. for middle of the road. It, it really is. It really is. And we wanted to make sure that we hit that right price with the right features in an entire series of scopes. Um, unique models within there. We've got two scopes that we call super compacts. This is a 3 to 12 and a 4 to 16. So here you have a 4 to 16 high magnification rifle scope that's super compact. It's barely over 9 inches long. Wow. This is a first focal plane model with locking ballistic turrets and uh, magnifying reticle. It's going to go great on MSR rifles. Oh yeah. Um, you know, so we've got some super compacts in the line and we've got some full size rifle scopes. But this line will outsell all of the other scopes. Oh yeah. Five, five to one in the next in the next 12 months. It's now, great. are these, can somebody purchase these directly off your website if they wanted to? They are available on the website. The rifle scopes are coming in a couple of months. The okay. range finder is coming right now. Uh, but they are available on the website. Our website is gpo-usa.com and you can get videos of what's going on there. Okay. You can get all the technical specifications you need. Great. All the all the information now, is there. if they use a local dealer, could they ask their local dealer to call you and order this product direct or do they have to go through a distributor to get that? No, 100% we are direct dealer okay. fo focus right. in this company. So if they've got a local dealer they like to work with, they can have that dealer contact you and get 100%. this shipped out. 100% correct. Awesome. Hey Mike, thank you so much today, buddy. We appreciate it. Guys, let's keep covering the show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes back with you for SHOT Show 2024, continuing our coverage. I'm here at this company's booth. You see it up there? Watchtower. Watchtower Firearms, yes, right? Sir. Here with my buddy Garrett. Garrett Lust from Watchtower. I had to stop and show you guys this new double stack. Garrett, show us what you got here today. Sure. So what we have here, well, first off, I'll let you know, we started off end of last year introducing this. This is our Watchtower Apache. Q View Edition. This is a limited edition run. We made a thousand of these. However, we sold out of these thousands so quick, we had to introduce something brand new. So now we have these. That's a good problem to have. It's an awesome problem to have, realistically. Now show us what we got down here now. So what we have down here is our non-limited Apache. So what you get out of this is that we do have our 4.6 inch barrel that is integrally compensated. And that's smooth as butter, by the way. Butter is the common theme that we heard over over and over and over again. We love that yes. about it. So it's a very, very nice package. Um, very competitive price point compared to its its competition. Um, all PVD coated in-house by us, machined in-house by us. Um, it's just a really nice high-end race gun. And you're a Texas-based company, we right? We are. We're based out of Spring, Texas, just north of Houston. Just north of Houston. Yep. Awesome. Now, is this a different model or just a different color just version? Just a different color version right here. So we're offering it, as you see here, in a graphite and copper and graphite and black so you get your choice of what you like if you want to bling with a little subtlety or just full bling we have the option i got you now you, so gary you guys also make a good line of ars right yes sir yes sir so manufactured in spring texas make it everything in-house um, known for more of our billet work but we do have forgings as well um, essentially it's just a full-on very heavy duty grade ar okay with options of cold hammer forge chrome line barrels to 223 wild precision sub moa options very nice yeah. stuff so 
somebody want to find some more information about Watchtower Firearms, where do they go? Watchtowerfirearms.com. Watchtowerfirearms.com. Guys, check them out, especially that double stack. You're not going to be disappointed in that. Let's keep covering the show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes back with you for Outdoor News America. Continuing our coverage of the 2024 SHOT Show. Here my new buddy, Chris, from U.S. Ordnance Manufacturing. I had to show this to you because Chris really kind of rolled my socks up and down with this. Chris, show us what you sure, got here. Sure. So this is the M60 E6. Um, you may have recognized the name M60 from the old Vietnam era guns you see in the helicopters and movies. But uh, since then, we've really uh, brought this into the, the modern era. We've redone the gas system a little bit, played with the internals a little bit as well. Um, it's got Picatinny rails, you got a vertical grip on it, a nice hook on the buttstock. Um, a lot of uh, a lot of uh, programs will still use this um, in helicopters and you know in a roll of fixed in amount, uh, but set up this way so they can actually get out of there if something's wrong with the craft. They can get out of there with this gun and you know hopefully uh, fend off the bad guys. Yeah, take it with them. Uh, yeah, and and the, the other th nice thing about this is we also make a version with some spade grips on the back. So if you want to have it in that classic role, you can do it. Now we need to make it real clear with yes, our please. audience yeah. that this is government buy only, yeah. guys. You're not going to buy this and mount it to your Kia at home, no. okay? That's just not something you're going to be able yeah. to do. Now I would love to have one mounted to my Kia, but you know, not going to be able to do that. But I still wanted to share this with you because I thought it was really, really cool. And Chris was nice enough to share it with us. So Chris, thank you so thank much, you. buddy. Guys, let's keep covering the show. What's going on, guys? Josh Sykes back with you, Outdoor News America, continuing coverage of our. 2024 SHOT Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm here with my longtime yeah, buddy. Man, we've known each other a we, minute. Hey, listen, we've been around the block. Yeah, you? absolutely. So, yeah, so so here, this is Jacob Gray Firearms is probably uh, a company that you may or may not heard of. I met met them at a writer's conference this year. So I'm going to turn it over to you, Jay. Tell us about what's happening. Yeah, man. Hey, guys, I'm Jay Duncan. I'm the uh, VP of Marketing here for Jacob Gray Firearms. Yeah. And like Josh said, we're a, a newer entry in to the firearms market. Jacob Gray's been around as an aerospace manufacturing company for a number of years. Uh, and about three years ago, we got into making firearms. Uh, they had a full line of modern sporting rifles. A friend of mine, Todd Neese and I, were hired on to Jacob Gray yep. about eight months ago. And we decided we wanted to make entry into the double stack 1911 market. Which is super hot right now. It's super at hot. shot show. Double stack, double stack, double stack. But I can tell you, I had an opportunity to shoot this double stack at our writers conference. It's probably the sweetest one I've shot yet. Well, I appreciate that, man. Yeah, you you hit the nail on the head. It's a, it's a, a very wide open market right now with double stacks, and we think we've got a really good blend of features and yeah. benefits that appeal to customers. Show us all about it. So the biggest thing that you'll notice that you know looking at some of these components is uh, even our pot, our grip is CNC machine from billet aluminum, right? Oh, wow. So this starts life as a big block of aluminum, goes into a an Akuma CNC machine and an hour and a half or two hours later comes out looking like this. Nice. We do the same thing with the frame. We do the same thing with the trigger. We do the same thing with the beaver tail. So the one thing that you'll notice about that trigger is that most 1911 style triggers have a bow and a shoe and then they're riveted together. We're building this out of one piece of billet. It's a one piece trigger. Oh wow. So we've got a three and a half pound uh, trigger pull in the TWC. I guess I forgot to tell you all. Yeah. It's called the TWC. C. Throwback with capacity. Throwback with capacity. And it's chambered in nine millimeter. I like okay, it. so it's a four and a quarter inch barrel. Uh, it is a 416 stainless barrel. And then we have a 416 stainless slide that is then nitrided black. Wow. Comes standard with uh, excess suppressor height stites. Okay. And then also comes optic ready. Okay, what I mean by optic ready is this, uh, this gun comes with uh, a cover plate, and then it also comes with adapter plates for the the RMR and the RMSC. Sweet. So you buy your gun if you've got an RMR or an RMSC pattern red dot drops right onto your pistol. Excellent. So, so if somebody wanted to purchase one of these handguns, where do they need to go to do that? Yeah, uh, come see Jacob Gray or jacobgrayfirearms.com or find one of our stocking dealers across the United States. Awesome, guys. Let's keep covering the show. 
All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed our interviews today, SHOT Show 2024. We're going to be back at it tomorrow. So if you have not subscribed to the channel, you need to do so. you got to subscribe to the channel to watch. Hit that little subscribe button down below. Leave us a thumbs up. And until tomorrow, we'll talk to you soon.